wall mounted charger. Before parking the vehicle for charging, ensure to apply the EPB and turn the ignition off. Turn on MCB power supply, infinity and XLED will glow, indicating charger booting. Notice. 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 Open the charging lid. Remove the dust cap in vehicle normal charging port. White illumination of the charging system LED indicates vehicle SOC percentage. While the charger prepares for charging the vehicle, blue LED remains blinking. Tap valid unique RFID tag on the card reader to initiate charging. Charging the vehicle will start after the RFID LED blinks three times. Until vehicle SOC reaches 100%, blue LED on the wall charger blinks continuously, and charging system LED glows in tidal pattern. Charging indication telltale lamp will blink until charging complete. Tap RFID tag on card reader to stop charging. Once charging is complete, the tidal pattern of green LED of the charging port and X pattern on the charger remains static and charging telltale in DID turns off. Unlock the doors to release the charger gun. Gently pull out the charging gun once the charging session is over and place it back on the charger. Close the charging port dust cap and the charging port lid. Caution. Notice. Caution. Wall Mounted Charger, ME for You Apps. Open the ME for You menu drawer and select Home Charger to view or update charger details. A short summary of the Home Charger, along with the option to purchase additional chargers, is displayed on the home screen. Home Charger settings can be accessed by tapping the three dots in the top right corner and selecting the Settings tab. When Auto Start Charging is enabled, 
charging will start automatically when the connector is plugged into the vehicle. The home charger can be operated in community mode, allowing members to be added or their requests to be accepted. Tap on Add Member to add a person to the shared use of the charger. Enter the username, mobile number, vehicle registration number, vehicle manufacturer, and model name. Then tap Save. The list of added members will be displayed in order and can be modified. Swipe on a name to delete that member. Requests from individuals wishing to join your community charger will be listed here. Approve or reject as needed. Generate a QR code for your home charger to allow others to join in community charging. The generated QR code can be shared with others who wish to join the community charging group. Use the raise an issue option to report any problem with the home charger. Tap on create ticket, select the issue category, add remarks, and then tap submit. A ticket overview with closure details will be displayed once the issue has been successfully resolved.